Welcome back to Snipe City Cards. We brokered a trade for Chris for some Gretzky rookies. Uh, first, we went on FedEx, our arch nemesis, to see what they would charge us to ship these to BC with $8,000 insurance. And uh, we're in around three, dollars $400. So we said, forget that. Let's just go ourselves. Um, the flight to BC was less than that. These are the cards. We got a top Gretzky rookie PSA 8, sophomore year PSA 8, third year PSA 8. They're all PSA 8s. We got an 84 and 85, so a complete tops set. Um, and then that was basically it. We uh, landed in Vancouver. We drove out to BC. Unfortunately, the person that purchased it did not want um, to have anything on uh, a video of him or anything like that. So we sat at a coffee shop. We met up with him. And uh, then we figured, what else can we add to this video? So we went to Pastime Sports Card and Games. Pastime is a great place to buy your sports cards in BC. And uh, we picked up a bunch of this stuff. And also, sitting around in BC that a friend got me was another Power Cube. So uh, this is roughly about $200 worth of stuff. So a friend of mine had a Power Cube and this Tim Hortons. Uh, this is two years ago, Tim Hortons card. And we've got a Kale McCarr promotion so that's not too bad there uh now we're gonna get into some upper deck and first up we've got a young guns it is anunin eustace anunin young guns and uh we're gonna get our second pack here uh, we got a little die cut here a ud3 okay not bad spencer knight future impact number to a thousand from extended UD3. So off to a good start on our two extended packs. Already made up for the purchase price on both of them. Okay, let's get to the next one here. We got a fluorescence Taylor Radish and a Young Guns behind it. Okay, <laughs> we're doing well. We got Justin Richards Young Guns and a red fluorescence of Radish. So actually doing a pretty decent job. We get to our next pack of Series 2 here. And upside down, we've got another Young Guns. I don't know why they're upside down here, but it's Ivan Provetsov. Prosvetov. I know there's no S after the T or in and around the T. i got to remember that. Okay, next up, we have some Series 1, and we've got a... Wow, we've got a Pitor Kochekov. Am I saying that right? Black Young Guns Canvas. He's been playing really well in his role in uh, in uh, Carolina there. He's got some great stats this season, so that's a pretty solid card. That one's awesome. We're killing it thus far. No complaints. Let's go next up. Here is a Dazzlers of Carter Verhage. So we're way up on the extended series, the Series 2 and the Series 1 of this year. We're going to get into Artifacts. Haven't opened this on the channel yet. And Artifacts Blasters. I have not seen good things about these. This blaster box was $20, $30. Too much. Let's, let's leave it at that. Uh, first off, we've got a Kalen Addison rookie with the gold foil there. And these are not numbered. That's like the one drop-off. Like, there's a lot of numbered stuff in Artifacts before, and now we're uh, we're not really getting too much of that stuff here. Uh, next up is Dustin Brown. So we got a Dustin Brown and a Kalen Addison from the pack before of the, the gold foil variant there. Uh, next, we've got another one here, and it's Gregory Denisenko, so a rookie. Yeah, it'd be, it'd be nice if even they just threw some sort of numbering on there, obviously. Everything's being over, like, numbered to so much these days. Uh, this pack doesn't... No, this is just a regular haul? Is that my imagination? No, there we go. That's a, that's a gold. Sorry. Sorry, that's a gold. Disregard that. Okay, next pack here. We have Charlie McAvoy. Gold variant. Uh, we got two packs of artifacts left. We started off very strong. It's kind of dropped off a little bit. 
Uh, that's a base. Okay, so I guess they have base packs in here. Five card base packs in artifacts. Am I missing something here? All right, last pack of artifacts. Uh, yeah, not a fan of this product. And it's another base pack. All right, there you go. There's a blaster of artifacts. Let's get into the power cube. Um, I see a Mitch Marner pack in the side there. Matthews Young Guns Canvas. Could it be? Let's get this open and uh, see what we have here. We have two packs of 1617 Series 2, so that's always fun. We've got a bunch of score, which we're not going to open. One of our friends off camera might open those score packs just for kicks. Let's take a look through the uh, stack that comes in the middle. Actually, first, let's let's see what we got here. 18, 19, Glossy Rookies, and an MVP pack there. Uh, so we got the MVP factory set stuff there. We got some old stuff, some 18 or 19, 20, sorry. Um, sometimes they have young guns in here, so it's always good to go through or, or some inserts. This one is nothing. All right, let's get to the MVP pack. Not expecting much from these MVP blaster packs here. Uh, and we have a Ryan O'Reilly short print. So they changed the color on the short print there. Okay, let's get to the glossy. Brady Kachuk, Elias Pettersson, and Elias Pettersson Red. There you go. That's got to be like a couple of bucks, five, ten bucks on the glossy pack alone. Okay, the main attraction. Haven't hit any big young guns out of all these power cubes that we've opened. And we got a portraits here of Matthew Barzal. So Barzal portraits, last pack of the power cube. And we do have two packs of metal. We've got an OPG marquee rookie update of Tom Kunockel. Yeah. All right. So started off strong, fell off a little bit. These metal packs were $26 a piece. Metal is very make or break. You got to get really lucky. So this will basically make or break the packs we've got here. We've got an Allon. Okay. We're going to slide through some of the base here. Where's that Allon again? And behind Matt Murray. Alon, show me someone good. Rookie, I know they have Alon rookies. It is a Nico Heeshear. Yeah, Nico Heeshear. Alon, which is one of the tougher ones to hit. I don't recall because it's been a while since we've opened this, but I'm pretty sure these are like, there might be one in each box or one in every two boxes. One in 15, one in 30, something like that. I'm not even going to bother checking. Last pack here, looking for obviously a PMG, an auto, something fancy. We've got a... The Dylan Cousins net deposits, but those can be autoed as well. That would be a rookie auto. Uh, let's go. Show me an auto. Ah, just a regular Dylan Cousins net deposits. So we opened some packs. We sold some Gretzky's, and we got this Peter Kochekov. Remember, guys, the contest is still live. I know you guys like free stuff. I know you guys don't like a crack Connor McDavid rookie, but that's why we got some other stuff in the works. Um, but make sure to participate in the contest, and the way to do that is to comment on this video. Uh, comment whatever you want. Let us know what you think about the Gretzky sales. I wish I had more content on that, but like I said, we, we couldn't really get any more on the video there. Um, let us know what you think about those packs that we picked up. And uh, anything you want, make sure you hashtag Snipe City Cards 100,000. And also, we've got the sale going on on our website. Every $50 you sell, you spend will give you another ballot entry uh, for the contest. And uh, free shipping, no taxes on our website as well, snipecitycards.ca. Hope you guys enjoyed the video and your December is going well. Thanks for watching.